Hello, today's video is on our stock number 35644MP, the uh, clear uh, acrylic case for the Arduino Mega incompatibles. Uh, that's not included, we're just working on the case today. Uh, I thought I'd make a quick video showing you how to assemble it because there's a few little things if you're not paying attention can uh, can frustrate you. It's kind of like a puzzle box. Once you've done it, you'll, you'll not have any any issues doing more. So uh, here we go. Well, first off, it will come to you like this in a bag with a bag of little hardware. Uh, I've already gone ahead and peeled off all the paper tape just to save us time. So let's let's get started. Uh, this is the bottom plate. There is, ooh, there is a right side up and a wrong side. Uh, if you get it and you put it, and the the holes don't mount, the mounting holes for the Arduino don't mount. Uh, and you've got it upside down, so pay attention to that. Okay, so this is the inside of the box. This is the bottom side. So I'm going to take, you have four small screws, shorter screws, and four longer ones. So I'm going to go ahead, it'd be nice, there's six mounting holes, but they only gave us six screws, uh, four screws, I'm sorry. But I'm, so I'm putting them through. Now, first helpful hint, uh, I've taken little pieces of uh, scotch tape and just kind of stick them over the, the screw heads. That way they'll just stay in position, just makes it easier for you. Alright, now the next issue is this little piece. Need to make sure we get this in place before we put the board on. Oops, I'm sorry, I forgot. There are four little clear spacers. We have to get these to make the board stand off the bottom. And they're slippery little guys. Flip my glasses up here. And you see how the, the tape helps them stay in place. So you must have this end piece, which has the power in the, in the USB connector. And you must have it flipped to the right direction. So that's kind of the, the second thing. If you don't have that, you can set, find out mounting this to the board. Then all of a sudden, you don't have that piece there. Okay, now let's get these tiny, tiny little screws. You don't have to tighten them all the way, probably best not to. That way you have a little bit of wiggle room. Now they only gave us four standoffs, and there's actually six holes. I'll have to talk to the company about that, see if we can't get that fixed. And that's the problem with having tiny little nuts and trying to get them in place. There we go. Now this last one's in kind of a tight spot. That's why I have a small pair of tweezers. There. You only have to really get it started. That's the nice thing about the tape. It holds the, keeps the head from smitting. Okay, all right, you can pull that tape off. And don't over tighten them, it is acrylic. It can crack. You 
there you go. That's actually the toughest part, getting that done. Uh, this is all pretty simple and straightforward. Uh, you have two longer pieces and a short piece. And you can tell which way it goes. You have a larger dovetail and a smaller one. You can tell which one it goes up. And it's pretty simple, straightforward to figure out. Just have to line up all the little dovetails. And one always doesn't want to work. So kind of take that little I'll take the longer screws, put it through. Always have a hard time with these little nuts. Oh, come on, little guy. Work with me here. There we go. And there again, don't over tighten them. It is acrylic. As you can see, it's uh, pretty pretty flush. Allow you access to the uh, the headers. Uh, personally, I, I put the the bolts through up this way just to keep from scratching your table with the tenon and those screw heads. It'd be nice if they included some rubber feet. I'll talk to the uh, the supplier see if we can't get them to do that because you probably don't want these sticking up too much might interfere with your, your shields if you're plugging in any shields on the on the board. But uh, that is it. Hopefully this will uh, make you uh, your job assembling it that much easier. Thank you for watching our video.